Hi there, today I'm going to show you how to do a nozzle check pattern on an Epson XP6105. Now this process is a great way of troubleshooting print quality issues on your printer and it only takes a couple minutes and is well worth the time as a first step in my opinion. So, starting from the home screen of the printer, as we can see we are here, if you're not already there, just press the home button, get yourself there. Then we use the arrow keys to move along until we get to maintenance. Click OK to go into maintenance. The print head nozzle check is the very first option. So we press OK. Press OK to print and give it just a minute. And after just a few seconds, you'll be presented with a page that looks a little something like this. And as you can see, it's broken down all of the colors your printer can produce as it's got the double wide standard black cartridge. You've got two blocks there because it comes out of two separate jets in the bottom of the cartridges into the print head. Um, also sign yellow, magenta, photo black. Now if you are having print quality issues, what you'd be looking for is little breaks along these fine lines here. If you see any like small breaks in there, that would be indicative of uh, stripes running horizontal across your prints, something like that. But any kind of gaps or even missing colours is uh, pretty self-explanatory. So you should have a good idea from here. And um, I would recommend doing some cleans to get you up and running. Um, and thankfully this machine kind of puts you into the position to do that nice and easily. So you can see here, check the printed pattern and select the closest result. I've got a perfect looking print, but what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go into this like I haven't, and this is where you would go if you had um, missing lines or prints, and then it automatically takes you into doing a cleaning cycle. So if that's the position you're in, go through that. You can just go in circles until you see an improvement in print quality, but hopefully, you're looking at something very similar to that and don't have anything to worry about. So back on the screen, I'm just going to press OK and we're done. But hopefully you found this useful. If you have, please do let us know with a like. If there's anything else you'd like to know, do let us know in the comments. We've got other videos for this printer. If you're looking for um, some more help with an issue you're having. Otherwise, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye bye.